I think uh, no matter if you're a pianist, what instrument you're studying as an, uh, if you want to become an artist and you really search for something uh, in music, then you should search for something in your life. And it's, it's a path, it's nothing that has an end that you say now, okay, now I know everything, that's not the truth. Born in East Berlin, 1971, when it was still part of the GDR, Maria Baptist is a true piano virtuoso. Immersed in classical music from birth, she was writing duets for herself and her trombone-playing brother while still a child. It was the discovery of jazz and the possibilities of improvisation that truly ignited her creativity. As an international piano competition winner, the fall of communism gave her intense musical curiosity greater freedom, and a move to the new school in Manhattan opened up further playing possibilities. Working with large orchestras and big bands as well as performing solo, she fuses influences as diverse as chamber music and deep grooves to produce music with power and emotion that has been showcased on seven CDs and at numerous live concerts internationally. An inspiring teacher as well as musician, we caught up with Maria before a concert in her native Berlin. I love Berlin. I think Berlin uh, is a really special place. We have all different cultures. Uh, cultures. It's really a, a, a place where musicians from all over the world come and live here. And you see that tonight in my orchestra, it's a great mixture of different uh, people from uh, all over the world. For me, absolutely, uh, jazz is really freedom and it's uh, you can really create your own world, your own uh, language, uh, you can express yourself, you can express different uh, emotions. Um, in a classical world, I think the biggest goal when I uh, interpret classical music is to have the freedom in the written parts, which is very uh, hard to reach, I think. So. There comes the jazz musician in me that uh, wants the freedom in the uh, written part in classical music, even though in my uh, jazz compositions there's uh, quite a lot of stuff also written out, but then of course there are improvised parts. So I think for me, uh, uh, my personal uh, uh, goal in music is to really combine uh, the two worlds uh, to uh, one language. You have uh, in a classical world a great approach to sound and this is something that I'm searching for in the jazz world to, to really pay attention to the general sound and to different dynamics and shadows uh, and shapes of music. So uh, concepts of like climaxes, of counterpoint, uh, of um, the concept of contrast, this is something I'm taking from the classical world and using it in my jazz world, for instance, as an example.
I would not like to uh, lose one of my projects because each one influences the others. So for instance, when I'm playing piano solo, I hear an orchestral sound as I would play with my orchestra. So this influences me in my solo performing. And the same happens when I play with my big band. For instance, I use parts that uh, I play solo or uh, with my trio. So my big band is a trio and a big band. personality that is really searching for something then you should go for it and if you really have a strong need you want to discover things you want to develop then it's a good profession <laughs>